Yo, yo, yo. Hope y'all had a wonderful spring break. Yeah. Oh, uh, we're talking about prom, student council, and more right after this pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. If you plan on attending this year's prom, the theme is Enchanted Evening. It was on Saturday, April 13th at 8 p.m., hosted here at the Clinton County Fairgrounds. The cost per ticket is $25, and remember that the price increases the last two days of the sales. Remember that you also need to have a signed parental permission slip before you can purchase your tickets. You can swing by and grab your slips and your tickets at the bookstore right next to the main office. In case you all forgot also, over break, there are many applications this month for scholarships, such as the Sci Desai, Ivy Tech, and the Stacy Ball Legacy Scholarship. For more updates about the upcoming scholarships, make sure to stop by Student Services or check the chatter for more updates. That's going to be all for me and Gun Show Irwin here. Now we're going to send it to Assassin and Anthony. Good morning, dogs. Welcome back from break. If you haven't noticed, Purdue is in the Final Four. The game will be held this Saturday with Purdue and North Carolina State starting at 6:10, and UConn against Alabama will tip off at 8:50. Can't wait for these games to happen. I hope you guys' brackets have, haven't been completely destroyed. Now that I've talked about March Madness, let's talk about sports here in the high school. The varsity baseball team opened up the season with two wins over West Lafayette Saturday, 13-7 and 8-7. Oscar Lopez picked up the win in Game 1, and Carlos Lopez earned the save with a dominating pitching performance in relief. In Game 2, Lu Lucas Wagner got the win with the two strong innings in the relief. Matthew Berry drove in the winning run through the walk-off win in the bottom of the ninth. Good job, guys. Let's stay locked in. Let's give a big congrats congratulations to the girls who were selected for the FHS cheer team for the 2024-25 season. There will be a mandatory parent cheerleader meeting tonight at 6 in the auxiliary gym for the cheer teams for the 2024-25 season. There will be a lots of inf very important information about the summer schedule. Camp and fundraisers will be passed out tonight at the meeting. Please plan to attend along with your parents. So that's it for, uh, for sports. Listen to Tessacina. Thanks, Anthony, and welcome back, really, all bowl. Today afternoon, there will be thunderstorms all day with a chance of hell. And the high is going to be 60 degrees and a low of 50 degrees. We have some winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. That's all for weather. Now back to Brian. Thanks, Susanna. Now, dogs, the applications are not open for student council. If you're interested, the applications are in your emails. The application will be open through today all the way up to the 5th this Friday. Now, for lunch today, in lines 1 and 2, we will be having chicken nuggets. In line 3, there will be biscuits and gravy. And finally, in line 4, there will be the option of a tenderloin. And a special happy birthday goes to Michelle Berrigan Arias and Joshua Hall. I hope you all have a marvelous Monday here from HCTV. Yep. I hope you guys have a great, yeah, Monday. <laughs> Sorry. That's, yeah. It's okay. Oh.